वाइल्ड स्टर्निंग इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक वेव प्रोपैगेशन यू मस्ट हैव लर्न अबाउट दिस वैक्टर ई क्रॉस एच वॉट इज दिस वैक्टर सम पीपल कॉल दिस वैक्टर एज पॉइंटिंग वैक्टर वाइल सम पीपल कॉल दिस एज पॉइंटिंग वैक्टर सो विच वन इज करेक्ट लेट सी इन दिस वीडियो इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक वेव द ईएम वेव कैरीज इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक एनर्जी और पावर अलोंग विथ इट एंड यू नो वी कैन प्रूव दैट स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द बेसिक मैक्सवेल्स इक्वेशन गिविंग सम एनालिटिकल ट्रीटमेंट वी कैन प्रूव दैट दिस टोम द क्लोज सर्फेस इंटीग्रेशन ऑफ ई क्रॉस एच दिस टोम्स gives us the power of uniform plane wave power of electromagnetic wave my dear now i i cannot include the complete procedure over here because that is not the title of our video but uh, in the derivation of the this pointing theorem and pointing vector we have seen that by step by step analytical treatment starting from the maxwell's equation we can get that we can conclude that this term the surface integration of e cross h it is analogous to the power of uniform plane wave the power carried out by the em wave yes or no and this thing this analytical treatment was first time done by english physicist john h pointing and hence my dear it is known as pointing theorem p o y pointing it is the name of scientist yes or no this theorem is actually known as pointing theorem and this vector e cross h it must be called as pointing vector p o y but my dear do you know that even if you write this as pointing vector p o i then also no problem then also you are correct no problem you can also write it as the pointing vector why the reason is very simple you know this term the surface integration of e cross h basically it gives us the power of that uniform plane wave power of that em wave yes or no this surface integration e cross h it denotes the power of em wave and you also know that the direction of that propagation of power the direction of the propagation of that energy it is given by the direction of this vector e cross h vector yes or no the direction of propagation of the power of this em wave is given by e cross h that means the direction of this e cross h points towards the direction of propagation yes or no what is direction of propagation it is the direction where power is flowing along which the energy is flowing yes or no so basically e cross h is pointing along the direction of propagation pointing along the direction of propagation of power of that em wave so my dear basically it points in that way so you can also write it as the pointing vector yes or no so simple keep it simple no problem basically e cross h should be called as pointing vector because it is the name of scientist j h pointing but you can also write it as the pointing vector both the way you are correct no problem but actually it should be the pointing vector